How are you? Well, this is Hiropoa. Uh, welcome to my channel once again. I'm so happy. Uh, this day we must be all happy that our results are out. The selections is out on time. So we're gonna have time to check out our results. And not only for today, but even tomorrow and the other day, next month up to uh, September, it will be all open all throughout. So don't check once and then you get discouraged or get disappointed. No, we still have up to September. So keep your, keep your, your confirmation number well nicely if you check today and you don't get a result keep on checking so don't don't get disappointed yeah we still have a long way to go so thank you so much uh subscribe to my channels thank you for those who are asking questions thank you for those who are commenting thank you for sharing my videos i'm so 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 much humbled and i'm so grateful I want to thank God for this opportunity once again and also to thank you my friends thank you for being there it's only because of you that's why I am here so and I'm so happy to have a friend like you so today 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 we're gonna talk about something very very sensitive and something that is very 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 important to us as we are getting selected so Today, I'm going to highlight two or uh, three things that we're going to have now in mind as we start the process. So now I said uh, the results are out. If you have not checked, go, 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 go and check yours. And um, oh, let us know that you have been selected and we will also be happy. Okay, we are waiting to hear that and now then what here comes another question very very important so some people are not asking about the host other people are asking about the house where do i get the house when i come am i going to get job immediately and thank you so much for those questions are very very important and they carry a lot of weight so i'm here to talk about that and uh share my video and also tell a friend tell a friend what happens next so now we are going direct to the form ds260 that is our next form that is our next process now and let me tell you that form ds260 that we are talking about it's another book it's just like a book it has a lot of pages a lot of pages that need a lot of concentration so if you are about to download that form make sure you have your time make sure you are ready as you start feeling okay you can save it if you don't finish uh, there is a room for that you can save it and then continue later you can continue another day because sometimes maybe they ask you uh, uh, something that is uh, that you don't have or you are not sure of so you need to inquire so there is a room for saving and continuing later when you are ready so the form that we are uh, that you will download that is that is ds260 is the one that will talk about your host but in this form they don't ask you who is your host like i'm asking now who is your host no you won't find that question in that form what, what they will ask you they will ask you the address you are going to live in when you come to america so they will ask you about the address of course the address belongs to someone 
That's why they're asking about the address. So the address belongs to someone and that's why they are asking you about it. So they don't, because they don't mind whoever is hosting you as long as it's a US citizen. So what they ask you, what do you do? You write the address there and there is a, okay, that part of the, the, the host, as I'm calling it, but I'm putting it in quotes because they won't tell you about the host. They will ask you about the address. Now the address you give out, what is required in that part of the, where you are going to live in US. And another thing, they don't mind. You have a choice to choose wherever you want to go. You have a choice to, to say where you want to live. Wherever you go, nobody cares. It's all your choice. So they don't select for you. So wherever you choose, that's okay. But let me tell you, my dear friends, this is where the forms and all that and the visa get delayed. When you talk about the address, where you are going to live, then you will have to share with your host. Let me call the person host because that is what we know. We know about host. They will uh, get all the details from your host and everything that is needed and even something that can show that uh, that person is ready to host you. I'll tell you what happened to me. I had a host and we 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 were all settled about the host. Now what I did, I only put the address and the name of the host and all that and, and everything that was required to be given out and I just said that was enough. But please my friend, let me help you this time. Please, for your host, talk to your host let him or her give you the uh, 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 other more details about him, like his ID, so that when you go for the interview, mine, I just went through everything until the interview day. When we went for the interview, they asked me um, about my host. Of course, they know about the host because I already sent through the forms. So they asked me, what do you have? Like an agreement that this person is hosting you. I said, we are in agreement, but I had nothing to show. Apart from the details that, that we, we, we the, that were in, on that form, we had nothing that shows about that person we did not even have an ID for the person who was hosting us. So we had a hard time. And what they they did after the interview and we had uh, everything was done and everything was okay. They gave me another form, a yellow form. And they circled the part they wanted my host to do. So you see the disappointment that I was telling you about? There are lots of disappointment, but not bad. But it's all because these people, they cared about my children. And I'll tell you the words they used. They told me, we cannot let you take these children to America without being confident enough that these children will be safe. So they cared about, about my children more than anything else and they told me frankly your interview is okay and we'll give you visas so what is remaining now tell your host to send us the documents that we have circled so you can see i felt like oh my god I did not expect this. I felt like crying because I thought now I'm done and everything is gone. And now I'll be waiting for my visa. Now imagine it was interview day and I have to go back one step again. But 
I was so confident because they told us you can change if the person does not give you the details that are needed. You have a room to change. And they showed me where I can uh, feel the form that I can also feel to show that I did not manage with this host. Now I'm, with, I'm doing with this one. But uh, it was okay for us. We were um, in agreement with our hosts. And so we were not in any uh, problem. It's only that we did not know what is needed. And that is why I'm telling you, please share this video so that somebody else can know what to do before it's too late. Because we did not even have time. Our, our medical was almost expiring. And if your medical expires, you're going to repeat. You do it again, let me tell you. You do your medical again and it costs a lot. So when it comes to your host, the person who is hosting you, they, there is nowhere in that form you will find them asking you host. They ask you about the address you are going to. So that's question I hope it is answered and very clearly that make sure you talk to your host and you can also do this talk to your host let your host help you fill the form ds260 because that person is an american and that's why they want an american uh, a u.s citizen to be your host or the person to who is hosting you so tell him or her to help you fill the form DS260. It needs a lot of time, yes, but you can create time together. Especially when it's night in your place, you can manage with the uh, during the day. You do it during the day, and your host maybe it's uh, maybe the evening if he or she wants it during the day. She can help you at night. If he wants at night, he can help you during the day. You can have an agreement. So that one is done. So make sure you have all the details for your host. Have his copy of ID and something that can show clearly that that person is ready to host you. Especially, especially, and I keep on saying, especially if you have a family. So make sure you are um, well settled there. So about I want to be very fast about the house. Um, they don't, they don't give you a house, and this is why they are asking you about the address where you are going to live. If you are alone, maybe you can even do with a hotel, but and you can also do with somebody who is not. Uh, actually, you won't, you won't fail. You won't lack somebody to host you be confident enough that you will get someone just check and when there is if you get your results are positive yeah you will get a host you get someone to host you and not necessarily a family yeah not your relatives a friend is okay as long as is a u.s citizen the other thing is about how uh job the job that you're going to get you won't find a job ready for you you will come and start where everybody else start so i told you you can study and also work so you when you come here you'll find so many people ready to help you and to guide you on the way forward like us we were very lucky to have a very good host you know we came here during covid and let me tell you we really struggled but our hosts they really worked for us. We went to school, to classes during COVID. We did our classes, we got the certificates and we were ready to start working. So we started working as even as we were still in our host house, as we were still being hosted, we started working even before we got our own house. But later we moved because we, uh, my family is big, so we had to move and then, but let me tell you, you get a good host, you are good to go. You are very, very lucky. Me, I was very lucky. 
very very lucky and i really thank god for my host they really really took good care of us so uh no house for you but you will get a house no job ready for you but you will get a job job is a must house is a must you'll get them you'll get them as soon as you need them so don't fear anything of where to stay or where to do what just get ready that you'll get your things done and another thing why they ask all these details and why we do the ds260 they will tell you about so many things and when you are alive you might also get your id already in your host place so they uh, do everything for you they uh, get your green card now the card itself that you are supposed to work with the green card what we call a green card now you get it from your host it might get uh, to your host even before you so you might be very lucky so you and you have that you are good to go you are good for to start anything then you get your social uh, security which is help, which will help you to do all other things like you get the driver's license where yeah, you have uh, uh, you have to get the social security first so you get everything uh, ready for you and you are good to go so don't fear about anything we are here also we can help ask question we are ready to answer you guys and we are ready to help you reach here <laughs> we are ready to help you to come to this place so uh so keep on keep on working hard keep on asking question keep on uh doing the right thing make sure you do the right thing i always repeat that if you want you don't want to your visa to delay so i urge you all let's uh now that we are in the process of running ups and down and uh, doing the thing, the, the paperwork and all that, uh, which is online. I said it's an online thing, so everything is online. Even the details that you are going to get from your host, you get them through online. So he will send it, he or she will send them to you. And then you don't print them out. You just send them as you are sending the other, the form DS-260 maybe you'll be asked to attach or something so thank you so much thank you so much i'm really happy i'm really happy for that uh, time and i really thank god uh, that there is somewhere that we are heading to so keep on subscribing to my channel share the videos uh, so yeah you can comment down there and also you can write to my facebook uh, inbox account i am shiro paul my YouTube uh, channel is also Shiro Paul, and I am so happy. I'm so happy to have you guys. And thank you so much for loving my video. And I'm so happy. I'm really happy. God bless you so much and have a good time. Bye.